Worker bees in a honeybee colony exhibit a highly organized division of labor based on their age and physiological development. The distribution of work among worker bees changes as to their age, and different tasks are performed at various stages of their life. Every worker bee, all female, that lives in the colony will be a nurse bee after she emerges from her cell. Once a worker bee finishes developing in her cell, she chews through the wax capping and emerges to join the hive. Before she moves into the role of nurse, she will clean out her own cell to prepare it for new eggs, pollen, or nectar. Once that's taken care of, she will immediately start tending to brood to ensure the health of any developing honey bees. When each nurse bee is ready to move on to her next role, she'll take on a new job and newly emerged workers will take her place. She might build comb, seal up the hive with propolis, defend the hive from intruders, store pollen, or act as undertaker to remove dead bees. There are so many other things to be done and there's no time to waste. Nurse bees are primarily tasked with taking care of the eggs, larvae, and capped brood in their hive. They feed all the baby bees and inspect the cells to see if anything is wrong or requires attention. Nurse bees make many visits to each cell and are constantly monitoring the health of the brood. Each worker bee will usually spend about a week in the nursery, tending to worker and drone brood as well as any developing queens. Feeding larvae with bee bread, a combination of honey, pollen, and worker jelly appears to be the main priority for the first few days. Nurse bees give each larva more food than they can eat. The growing larvae will be suspended in the milky white substance, while workers check the level within each cell to maintain a certain amount for them to consume. As of the third day, the larvae eat everything as soon as it's given to them and are too large to float around. Nurse bees carry out regular inspections to catch any issues quickly and determine what each cell needs, visiting each developing bee about 1,300 times a day. These can be longer or shorter visits depending on what needs to be done, and each growing bee receives a lot of attention over time. The average visit is usually just 2 to 3 seconds but sometimes can last 10 to 20 seconds for a quick checkup. Feeding can take anywhere from 2 seconds to 2 minutes or more. For more interesting and informative videos about honey bees, please subscribe our YouTube channel. Thank you.